I'm Jen Phillips. Today is Tuesday, September 3rd. Welcome back to reality. It's the day after Labor Day. Here's your short week and everything you need to know before you go in just 60 seconds. So start the clock. Lubbock police are looking for two people they believe could be connected to the shooting death of a teen last week. 17 year old Del Quavion York died. Five others were hurt. If you know anything, call Crime Line. A 19 year old is now bonded out of jail after police say he was under the influence when he hit a bus carrying the ACU football team after Saturday's game. Parker Young is charged with DWI. The four hurt are recovering. And rain. We always say it's great for farmers, but this time it's actually too little too late for some. September is also harvest month for a lot of crops, so the rain can get in the way of some of those processes as well. A family lost their home to a fire on Friday while on vacation to celebrate their dad and husband beating cancer. It's just not fair. They lost their dog and everything in their house, but their son says they'll rebuild. And injuries are rolling in for Texas Tech football ahead of their first road game of the season. This Saturday, the Red Raiders will be in Pullman, Washington to take on the Washington Cougars. And that game starts at 9 o'clock, first road game of the season. So those are just the bullet points. If you want to donate to that family who lost everything, if you know something about the shooting that killed the 17 year old last week, or maybe you want to know some more about the Red Raider injuries that are happening or where and how to watch the game on Saturday, all those things. And yeah, just about everything that's happening in the hub city are waiting for you over at everythinglubbock.com, including the forecast, which is definitely something you want to look at today. So have a great Tuesday and head on over to our website for anything else. I'm Jen Phillips.